and welcome to Zero Border Learning. Today, we will learn how to download and install OpenSolver for Microsoft Excel to solve linear equations. OpenSolver is a free alternative to Solver, which is an Excel plugin, and we can use OpenSolver for solving linear equations. I will also add in tutorials for how to use OpenSolver to solve real world business case solutions. So for that, let's first search for the open solver. So just Google for the open solver. Open solver is there for the opensolver.org. I have already opened it in another tab. So once you go to the open solver, you have download and install. So once you go to the download and install, uh, you can see the open solver source for site which opens the source for site. I've already opened this. So there are quite a few versions for this open solver. What I use is the stable version, which is a 2.9.3 for Windows. If you are a Mac user, you can all also download and install the linear win.zip as well. So you can just click on it so that the download will start. I have already downloaded the open solver and the open solver is there in the downloads you extract the open solver and you will get the following files of these following files the file that we require is the open solver.xlam to start working on the open solver you can just double click the file it will open you have to enable the macros and you can straight away work on this particular sheet to solve the data as well but we will show you how to actually install that into the MS Excel so that you can use it for any file and accessible in the data tab every time. So for that reason, I'm opening the Excel sheet. And within the Excel sheet, you can go to the Options tab and within Options, you will find something known as the Add-ins. Click on the Add-ins and then go to the Manage Add-ins. So once you have that, you can really see there is a solver add-in, which is not open solver, which is the paid version of the solver. So to add in uh, this plugin, we browse and we can go directly to the downloads where we have downloaded. You can select this particular open solver XLAM and that will add in the location. So once you click that and you add in, you can actually see the open solver that is being added into that particular solution. Uh, the other way that we can use is to copy the entire contents of this Excel open solver or just the open solver Excel aim into the uh, roaming data of the Microsoft. So the roaming data of the Microsoft will be inside the users, C users, your username, and then there's an app data roaming and then you have Microsoft go into the Microsoft and there are add-ins to that so you can just copy paste the files here that will also add in the Excel solver or the open solver into your Microsoft so that even if you delete your download files your plugin will still be active so I'll go back to the Excel file I'll Browse again for Open Solver, and right now I am going to select it from Roaming App Data, Microsoft Roaming Add-ins. So I select that, click OK, I replace it. So there is the Open Solver added to it. Once I click OK, you can see within the Data tab. If you click on the Data tab, you have the Open Solver to the far right corner as well. And for more details on how to use the Open Solver, you can browse the playlist and study. The support files is available in the blog as well. So you can follow the blog link, which is given in the description. And if you like this video, subscribe, share with everyone that you know, and give a like. Thank you.